Thomas Badger Ward, tune in the Sport and Icons. Smoking Joe. How are we doing? How are I'm we doing? good, how are you? I'm all well, I'm all well. Fit and healthy. It's actually up. our first ever interview, you know? I think it is. It is? It is, yeah. That's weird though, yeah. isn't it? It Day is so you're fighting tomorrow night on the uh, Phil Jeffries MTK show. Um, this will be your bounce back fight, can we call it that? Definitely, definitely. Um, last, last time out here, things didn't go to plan. But you know what? I'm ready. I'm ready to put that behind me and just get my career back on the right path now. What was it that uh, you thought cost you the last fight? Um, possibly inactivity. Definitely inactivity didn't help out. Yeah. But you know what? Craig Derbyshire, he turned up mm -hmm. in the best performance I've seen him in to be honest um, I'll, I'll, I'll learn a lot from it I'll learn a lot from it we, we're working hard in the gym to put things right and we will definitely do that yeah. and so who's this lad you're fighting tomorrow? so I've got an African opponent coming in for tomorrow um, Adam Yahara I think he's his second name mm -hmm. I think I pronounced that right okay. um, he's a South Park decent record um, he's won 23 fights I think Lost about seven, knocked out about ten of them. So he's got a decent KO ratio. Um, I'm looking forward to getting in there. You know, another southpaw for mm. me. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna get the job done. And how do you get on with southpaws? You like fighting southpaw? I don't mind them to be honest. Really? Ever, ever since my amateur days, you know, fighting southpaws has just came naturally to me. So yeah. it, w it won't be an issue tomorrow night. So what you're looking forward to doing tomorrow? Are, are you looking to just dominate him, or are you looking to stop him, or? You know, put on a good performance, put on a good performance that, that's going to stand out and show people what I'm really about because yeah. I believe my last fight I didn't get to do that, so this is my opportunity. Yeah, that's it. As I said before to you, um, it's good that Phil Jeffries has uh, got you out so quick. Oh yeah, 100%, 100% because I could have been sat at home for another six months, you know, with how things are, yeah. boxing is on, on the up again, so I just want to thank Phil Jeffries, I want to thank Rain and Arena. I want to thank my management as well, MTK Global, you know, for yeah. getting me the opportunities so quickly after my last fight. And this onwards and upwards from here. It is. So all going well with this one, which I'm, I'm sure it will do. Will you be looking to get that rematch on with uh, Craig Derbyshire? Yeah, definitely. Definitely. We're going to we're gonna be fighting again um, in, in the future. Right now I'm com competing at flyweight, yeah. which I think is more the natural weight for me. So yeah. we'll, we'll see what happens after this fight and we sit down with the team and see where we're at. So the new year. You're on the, um, is it, the, are you on the Probellum show? I am, December December 18th, just got announced yesterday. Yeah. So we'll see who the opponent is for that show. But you know what, I'm keeping busy to just what I need, to be honest. Exactly. All right, Joe, I mean, uh, best of luck tomorrow. Thank you very much. Uh, I'll be there thank supporting you, you and uh, cheering on Smoking Joe. You know what, I can't wait. And thank you, I just want to give a massive shout out to all my sponsors, you know, from the North East. Um, Really appreciate all the support that you've given me, especially throughout during COVID. You know, when when I wasn't really active, um, you, you supported me massively, and I just want to say a big massive thank you. And um, I've got a few on the back as well. Yeah, we got them. Some of the best companies in Teesside. Spot on.